Hello everyone, Sheila back again. Welcome to my channel. As you can see, I am wearing my jumper. It's all stitched up, so I have just a little bit video to show you the full thing, what it looks like. So I'm going to pause this video for a few seconds and let you. I'm modelling it for you. Well, this is how my sweater turned out, everybody. See, it's a perfect fit, actually. And I'm trying to model it like one of those models, but I'm not very good at it, so this is like, yeah. I'll show you with that too. I'm trying to hold my stomach in so it doesn't show all the bulges. <laughs> because with it being ribbed, it does show those things like that. But never mind, it's just for a few minutes. So I hope you like it. And what's come out like? So that's enough of my modelling. Get back to what I was doing before. Well, that's how my sweater turned out. And even if I say so myself, it's a very good and very good fit. I'm not the best at modelling, but I tried my best. Even holding my stomach again to hold all the bulges, so. <laughs> but anyway, I've had a very busy day today. I started trying to do this video earlier on today. That was when I did the, the little bit modelling my sweater. My granddaughter landed. I had just started, just done that little bit video. And then I sat down on my settee and I'm going to do what I'm doing now. And then I seen my granddaughter's car pull up outside, so she came with the tribe, the three kids and the two dogs. <laughs> so we had a good afternoon, went for a long walk. There's a lot of tracks around where I live. There used to be pit heaps in that um, years ago when I first came to live here probably about 35 years ago. There was a lot of pit heaps and what was left of the, the pit heaps and all that. And they were all levelled out and there's some lovely tracks with some, some nice walks. A lot of mud on them at the moment as well with the, um, all the rain we've had. We had to give the dogs a good wash down when they came back. They weren't getting into my house in that state. <laughs> but I think the... They ran around, they were running around on the grass and I think we washed a lot of it off on the, um, because the grass was still wet and... And then I made some lunch for us all and... And the kids were playing, you know, I've got big boxes of Lego which bring them down for the kids to play with and... We were just looking at old photographs on... The internet, actually, on the internet. And then I remembered, I said to Frankie, you know what, I've still got my old camera. I think it might be worth a bit of money because it's still in the same box and everything that I bought it in and it's never been used for a lot of years. We were telling them, you know, how we used to take photos where you put them in the, the film in the camera and you had to wind it on to the thing and then you had to look through a little hole in the thing and sometimes, you know, you cut the heads off or <laughs> they weren't very good photographs and then you had to send them to get developed. It's not like nowadays with our phones and that. And he was very interested in my phone. He was looking. I couldn't even remember how to open the flaming thing. <laughs> we were both looking, but something that interested him for a change. But I've seen it was lovely fresh air, it's a lovely day. I've got lots of washing hanging on the line. I'm going to have to go and get it in before. It's been a lovely sunny day and it was quite warm actually for a change. All the rain we had last night because when I came out the bingo, I was at my bingo last night. And my granddaughter did message me first yesterday because she wanted to come yesterday. But then I said I was going to leave about five about five, half past five because me and my friend Anne, we go for a meal on the first Thursday in every month before the bingo. So she said, oh, I better leave it until another day. And so she asked if I was in today. And I said, I am in every day. So that's how they come to land today. But we were at the bingo last night and 
We didn't win a lot. I won one five pound line. That was all. So we had two pound fifty each. It nearly paid for one of our games. And then it was pouring when we came out. It was, but it was nice driving up to pick my friend up in daylight because it's usually terrible when when I go to pick my friend up because it's usually dark. And there's a lot of traffic on the road and the lights off the cars and that. But with being daylight, there was no light shining in my eyes. And it's not so bad coming back. When I come back home, there's not so many cars on the road when I come home. So that's not so bad. But going there has always been terrible in the, the darker nights. But anyway... <laughs> That was it. That was all we won. Uh, so I am busy knitting after the kids went. It is now half four. They went away about four o'clock because uh, the dad was coming in from work, and I think they were going to their to their to their grandmother's actually uh, on a Friday. So Cheryl was going to drop them off at their grandmother, so she got rid of them for the night. Well, two of them anyway, the two youngest ones. They stop over on their grand, their grandmother's on Craig's mams on a Friday night. But the older boys, he's Frankie, he's staying with his mum and dad. But I have been doing a little bit. This, well, this is the second front. I have the. One front done, the back and one front finished. And I'm on with the second front, so it will not take too much longer. Get this one finished and then I'll get this one sewn up and the other one sewn up and I'll be able to put the, the neckband all the way around on it. And then after that, well, before that, um, I have that white blanket to finish. I'm going to finish that one first. And then I'm going to start knitting with this one. This one is just to sell. It'll be either a baby blanket or a, um, just a lap blanket for to keep somebody's knees warm. But this sweater here is the last sweater I'm doing for myself. I've been knitting cardigans because it's getting better weather. And I don't wear sweaters in the um the warmer weather. I like my cardigans or t-shirts and things. But I have got one of the um the balls of wool. The um the green that I'm doing going to do for um for Derek. So I'm going to do a um a swatch of that. I'll get that ball of wool I have that I'm going to use. Yeah, this is the wool that Derek's um, had sent to me if I to do his cardigan. So I'm going to do a swatch because I haven't done much knitting with this um, hayfield bonus. I've done a couple of things, but sometimes I've had some that's been very thick and it was more like nearly nearer to Aaron than actually um, double knitting. But this one seems like it's more like the normal double knitting. So... I have to do a, make sure I do a swatch to make sure I get the sizes and the um, the inches right that I have to do. Because Derek's a big lad, so I have to make sure I get the right size for him. <laughs> but I'm going to do the open mustard, so I'm going to do a little swatch with this before I start it. And as soon as I finish what I have, my other things, I'll be doing this during the day in my own of a night time. Because this is the last order. I won't be doing any more orders for anyone because it's, the weather's getting better and I can start getting out into my garden and start sorting out what I want to plant and things like that. But I will be doing those little bags that um, I'll be putting them on just to sell, probably onto eBay. So if anyone who wants any of the little bags, they see me crocheting any, just send me an email or they'll be on eBay when I get them done. But that's when I get time because um, 
I have these things I'm doing at the moment to, to finish. I have to work out what stitch I'm on to because I'm on to a new sort of another four rows. That's pearl two. Starting off with pearl two. So that's just my little bit for today. Catch up with um, everyone. See, I didn't have a video up yesterday, I don't think. I didn't I didn't have time yesterday, actually. I had that much to do, and I have a lot of washing hanging out on my line, so I'm have to go and have to get that in before I settle down for the um the night and sort myself some tea out. Although our lunch was a little bit late today, because by the time we went for a long walk with the um the kids and the dog, the dogs, and then got them sorted out and then I think it was about two o'clock by the time we come back and so we had to do some uh, lunch and that for, for us then. We just had burgers and I made some chips and and then I found I had no beans or anything like that with the kids so I says we put some cucumber and tomatoes on the, um, the plate for them that wanted them with eggs as well and a bit of egg and you know because I wasn't expecting them didn't realise I didn't have any beans or <laughs> But anyway, that's it for today. So I'll catch you all another day. So thumbs up and subscribe and bye for now.